Marylanders are recovering from a series of tornadoes hitting the state yesterday. No serious injuries reported, but communities are dealing with plenty of damage. The National Weather Service's five tornadoes touched out in four counties. One tornado in Carroll County had wind speeds of up to 90 miles per hour. WJZ is live. Pat Warren at the Army National Guard Recruiting Center in Carroll County, where one twister blew through the roof. Pat. That's right, there's tree damage out here, but for other areas, tree damage is the least of it. The damage done, the cleanup begun. The National Weather Service confirms five tornadoes skipped through Maryland Friday in Frederick, Montgomery, Cecil, and Carroll counties. Damage ranged from downed trees to collapsed buildings and roofs torn from houses. And you could hear everybody's cell phones going off with the emergency alert and they got us all to turn the machines off and stay away from the windows and things like that and it, it didn't last long but it was quick and it was nasty the tornado that hit carroll county traveled northeast through downtown westminster and jim richards neighborhood trees down behind my house top of my tree here we have a tree over there on, on my porch my porch posts were actually down here on my neighbor's property. In Frederick County, a barn and shed were flattened as well as damage to a silo and trees. Two tornadoes caused damage in Montgomery County, uprooting trees and several buildings destroyed. And in Cecil County, winds estimated at 100 miles per hour took down trees in Elkton. But as you said, Max, fortunately, there were no serious injuries reported. I'm Pat Warren reporting live from Carroll County. Back to you. Fortunate indeed. Let's bring in meteorologist Chelsea Ingram, who's tracking exactly what happened when this powerful storm rolled through. Chelsea. Hi there, Max. So we'll put it in graphic form just so everyone can see the cluster of okay. tornadoes that impacted portions of Maryland. A cluster located west of Baltimore from Carroll County down into Montgomery County. The majority of these tornadoes were either EF0 or EF1, but still enough to cause some major destruction. And then that one there in Cecil County. One thing I want to point out is that this is an unprecedented event event for the state of Maryland. This outbreak brought five tornadoes in one day. However, since 1950, there have only been reports of four tornadoes to have ever struck Maryland during the month of February. So this truly was unprecedented here at home. 